this is screw it it's Saturday and I thought I'll play Sh Hard Space Shipbreaker which is um how do I describe this it's a um it's a well uh, I think yeah the um uh, why you actually um, describe it is uh, you're an employee of a corporation, the Lynx Corporation, as you see up there, um, to scrap ships. You're basically take apart ships, uh, um, uh, take out what can be salvaged, and yeah. And you like get paid for it. There is a couple of um I haven't actually played this yet, so yeah. There's a couple of um difficulty settings. There's open shift, which is there's normally um a timer and oxygen deprivation, so that takes that out. There's standard you get unlimited lives, but you're under the clock. Limited, you get 30 revives for the whole campaign. And no revives. Yeah, I think I'm going to go open ship, because this is not going to be a serious playthrough. Anyway, uh, if you like this sort of thing, uh, be sure to stay tuned for my regular content. But uh, right now, yeah, stay tuned. Like, share, and subscribe. And here we go. Uh, Human kind is industrialized, watching the solar system. Us deteriorated into its place of squalor and decay. In orbit, a new breed of workers emerged the shipbreaker. The labor is extremely dangerous, but for a select few, it has to pay is worth the risk. God damn it. He can pause and read this. I need a... Oh, he does my jump name. Alright. Zones are reckoned that you'll be in frontier successful. Okay, I'm not a member of now. I have an associated with a workers' unit or the labor interest. Is this Amazon? Jeffrey, please. Oh, okay. I completely my annual uh, medical exam and have been cleared of having the call of salon. 
I have no commercial real estate interests on Luna in the Astro Belt or in the nation state of Arizona. What the hell was happening in this world? I will bring a positive attitude and proper summary mindset to work every day. Yeah! I understand, except I hope the risk associated with long term exposure to a va- Oh, yeah! To a Vantavos field. Actually, wouldn't it, wouldn't it still be a thing in this time zone? Because, it, yeah, it says this is like 2329. Will that even be a. Oh, jeez. <laughs> um. Anyway, let's just look. <laughs> and I will vote for this guy. You know? <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. <laughs> Sure. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Uh, tests. Any time without, with or without their knowledge. Oh, Jesus. Grants permission to links to the authority to gunch their wage if their actions are like they will post only real potential losses for the company and of its affiliates. Employee by grants permission to links to the authority for the two v two to record and own their DNA and to create new entities with said DNA with no restrictions or limits. The fuck. Furthermore, employee plays to play a normal fee for the service in the event of their death while performing the duties of their position. Links may execute these entities at any time, perhaps of course negligence. The boy hereby grants permission to the employee to study, manipulate, reciprocate, and duplicate any and all of my grey and white matter at any time. In the unfortunate event of my total and complete loss of memory. I'm not sure memory works like that, but okay. Employee hereby grants permission to links the authority to transfer any and all burn paid debts out to links and any and or any of its affiliates, their next of king. In the event they are terminated, disappear and or perma perish. Links reserve the right to terminate this contract at any time without notice of payment in Leo without no requirement of sufficient cause. Fucking hell. This is a dystopian future. Title screen. into the yard to earn his wages working hard. I pray to the stars and heaven above to return my daddy to those he loves. If there comes a time when he and death meet, the next cutter that takes his seat. Yeah, that's cool. Welcome Hello, Cutter 9346-52. Your automated Lynx onboarding experience will now begin. Please observe this important message. Faith, boundless promise, limitless resources, a brighter future. It's here that hard workers like you 
the backbone of civilization, will help us pave the way to the galaxy. <laughs> I'm Calicia Rye Paulson, oh my God. president of Lynx Corporation Salvage Division. <laughs> when my great great grandfather, Sorry, Exeter, founded Lynx, he foresaw a remarkable opportunity among the stars. His vision eventually brought us the rail gate. Now, spanning all the way to Jupiter, these are the veins connecting all of modern civilization. And the people flowing through them are its lifeblood. The rail gates reinvigorated humanity and are key to our continued progress. You have been selected from among thousands of candidates to join the Lynx family. This is more than just a job. It's an opportunity to be part of the largest, most successful, and most pioneering company in human history. <laughs> your dream may be to forge your own destiny one day. Well, work hard, heed your superiors, believe in the Lynx vision. Do this, and you too will get your chance. Your first step is to join our EverWork program. The greatest gift we give our employees, turning death into an ongoing opportunity for learning and growth. With Lynx, death is a fresh start. Good luck. I am in awe at how little this has changed over the years. It's 2329 and... Employee videos have not changed at all. <laughs> yeah, okay, I, I'll, I'll, I'll fucking extract my DNA, doctor. Ah! Video observation complete. To finalize onboarding, your genetic sequence will now be extracted for use with the Lynx EverWork Asset Replacement Program. Don't worry, pain levels during extraction are largely tolerable. Okay. Yeah. Please note, as outlined in section 31 of your employment agreement, the process of genetic extraction will destroy your original body. Oh, wow. Beginning extraction now. Don't space. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh my God. I knew going to space was expensive, but holy shit! Uh, oh, hey. De-gorsing, de-lousing? What? $1.2 billion. Wait, billion? 
thousand million trillion. Wait, is that a trillion? Hang on. Wait. No, that's a billion. That's a billion. I know, I know how the numbers work. Fuck me. Salvage rights free. Can't maintenance free. Dis display. Wait. Display of fees report. Seven dollars. <laughs> Administration free. Wait. Admin fees. Five hundred. Account maintenance fee monthly. Two thousand fifteen dollars. Financial account setup fee. Five thousand dollars. Salvage rights. Immigration duty fee of fifty nine thousand nine ninety nine ninety nine. Meal prep annual twenty. Wait, thirty four million. Fuck. Habitation fee cleaning repainting six million. Gratuity thirty five percent. Are you kidding? Oh my god. This feature is scary. But also hilarious. But also scary. Sure. <laughs> alright, alright. Breathe. Breathe. You're okay. Everything's gonna be just fine. There you go. Plenty of folks feel a bit woozy with their first bear. Anyway, Whoa. welcome aboard. The name's Weaver. So I'm the foreman for yourself and a couple of the other shipbreakers in this region. This here's Morgan Whoa. Station. She may not look like much right now, but once we boot her up, she'll purr like a kitten. All right. Let's test out your orientation control. Do me a favor and look up at that cargo elevator up above. That's it. So that's where all the salvage gets collected to be picked up by the transfer crew. All right. Just in case you ever turn yourself out of whack, use your roll thrusters to reorient. Q and E. All right. Now let's get you flying. Activating your thruster controls now. Try moving around. Now, vertical control. Checks, I need you to fly to these waypoints. Ooh. I really like the um, uh, like ascend a little bit. Oh. Yeah. Love how, ooh, slow it down a little bit. Slow it down a little bit. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> this is actually really hard. Holy shit. <laughs> I'm not cut out to be a belter. I used to be a cutter myself, you know. Till there were some uh, uh, complications with my last revive. Those were early days in the tech, though, so never you mind about that. Oh, almost forgot about the most important thing. Brakes. Get yourself going at a decent clip, and then test them out, why don't you? I think I'm pretty good with that. Dude, look at that view though. Oh, I 
need a break for one second. All Q and E at the same time. myself going for a little bit. All right. All right. Looks like the bay here was left in a bit of a mess. We're gonna clean this scrap up. Gonna activate the furnaces now. Ah, dang oh. thing. Would you just... There you go. So these furnaces are used to melt down soft metals. Should go without saying that these things are as hot as all get out. So try not to drift into them by accident. Okay, let's get a handle on your grapple tool. Okay. This fella here is a shipbreaker's bread and butter. This is how we move salvage around. Activate the beam and hold it to grab an object and move it around if it's not too heavy. Give it a go and move one of these pieces into either furnace. So when you're holding okay. an object with the grapple, you can retract the beam. This will pull a light object to you. If it's heavier than you, okay. it'll pull you towards it. Okay. So it's also... So this is actually probably modeled. Okay, so... Uh, let's start with this thing. Check out your HUD when you've got an object grapple. It shows oh, you the mass of the object and whether you can move it or not. I can't do that. That was a rim shot. Oh, miss. Fuck. Come back. Come, come back. Come back. No. Fuck. Actually, a really relaxing game. I think that no, it didn't. No, eventually fall in anyway. I like how really axing this is. Raw material processed. Credits deposited. Okay. Eleven hundred credits. I'm just gonna. Is there options? Uh, audio. Let's just turn the volume down to about 60. Yeah, save. Okay, so... I need to push an object, okay. Whoa, okay. 
Okay, that's really, really fast. Fuck. Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> oh, I got, I got myself this Jesus. <laughs> Ooh. What's this? That, that looks like it can be cuttable. Cut point. Can I cut yet? Grapple push. Job whoa, 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 uh, Let's move on to the bigger nanocarbon chunks now, shall we? Uh. You may have already noticed that these are too heavy to move with your gravel. Yeah. I'm enabling your scanner so we can check out their structural makeup. Go ahead and boot it up. This mode of your scanner lets you assess an object's structure. Uh -huh. What I want you to focus on right now are these cut points. Ah, oh, I saw those All earlier. Right. Control is giving me the go ahead to get you cutting. Okay. How do you push again? There we go. Should we go in there? All good. Now this beast 
is way too heavy to move as is. It's also too dense for your stinger to break it down, and there are no structural cut points for us to take advantage of. We're going to have to switch over to the split saw mode of your cutting tool and start slicing this thing down the side. All right. Go ahead and switch cut modes now. Oh shit. Slow ass. There we go. I thought salvage was... Salvage go.
Material deposited. I didn't read what I was supposed to do. Oh, let's see about there it is. It's a very chillax game. This is really fun. <laughs> Aluminium, I destroyed 1700. Strap, I made 318,000. That might be um yeah if for now if you guys like this please um uh, tell me down in the comments if you want to see this again for like a uh, live stream or something you know whatever I, I i can see this becoming a pretty good live stream candidate to be honest so uh yeah hello ship breaker you have one Incoming transmission waiting. Oh, there's like a crafting thing here. Huh. Anyway. Uh, yeah, I think we'll, um, yeah, stop it there. If you guys want to see, um, when we see me play this again, sign off in the comments. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. And yeah, I'll be back with another one of these, uh, next week. With another new game. Same old time. 
but you know, it's fine. Anyway, I uh, hope you enjoyed. I've been Purist, signing off.